Now let's move on to the packing in body centered cubic structure. It is clear that the atom at the center will be in touch with the other two atoms diagonally arranged. In the triangle E, F, D, you got F D square is equal to D E square plus E F square. So B square is equal to 2 A square, B is equal to root 2 into A. In an another example, I got the triangle A, F, D. You got A D square plus F D square is equal to A F square. So C square is equal to A square plus B square. Which is nothing but your B square is equal to 2 A square. Putting this one, you got 2 A square. So C square is equal to 3 A square. So C is equal to root 3 into A. So root 3 into A is equal to 4R and A is equal to 4R divided by root 3. We are able to write this one as R is equal to root 3 divided by 4 into A. So the length of the body diagonal C is equal to 4R where R is the radius of the sphere as all the three spheres along the diagonal touch each other. Moving further, the total number of atoms in the structure is 2. So their volume is 2 into 4 divided by 3 pi r cube. So volume of the cube a cube will be equal to 4 r by 3 root 3 power cube. So a cube is equal to 4 r divided by root 3 power cube. Now we got the packing efficiency which is given as volume occupied by 4 spheres in the unit cell into 100 divided by total volume of the unit cell which is given by 2 into 4 by 3 pi r cube into 100 divided by 4 by root 3 power r into r power cube so cancelling r cube and r cube You'll be getting 13052.352 divided by 192 percentage. So you got the value as 67.98 R 68%. So over here, I need a small change. This one is two spheres. It's not four. You got two spheres here. That's why the total number of atoms is two. Let's move on. There's a small correction, this one is 2 spheres. 